We brew a uh, beer for every pallet. We have probably, uh, if you include the brew pubs, um, we're probably at about 100 beer styles per year. Matt Potts is giving State Senator Jason Barrickman an in-depth look at his distilled brewery in Normal, including their nationally renowned sour beer lineup. What really gave us the attention nationally were our St. Decara Reserve Sours, which are all aged in the barrels behind us for about a year. Uh, very unique, uh, spontaneously fermented sours. Making the best brews means constant sampling of all the varieties. For the wild sours, the golden nectar is capped by a little stainless steel nail. And this enables us to sample the beer in the barrel without having to disturb the pellicle that's on t that forms on top. That protective coating on top of the beer, which protects the beer from oxygen, so we pull all of our samples from the nail at the bottom. Apparently the key to the tasty sours is the location of distill in the heart of farm country and the air we breathe. Because we have a great microflora in the air, because we're surrounded by cornfields and hog farms and cattle farms, uh, hay fields, etc. Those are the things, uh, the elements that we have in central Illinois that are so key to making wonderful sour beers that are so unique. This business is growing like wild hops. Matt plans to push out nearly 8,000 barrels of beer this year, and the whole operation started with a lone brew pub in Normal. With the goal of Distill, of course, was to really have a gastro brew pub, which really meant for us that the food would be of that same type of artisan uh, nature that the beer was. Now he has two brew pubs along with the production brewery, but future growth may be hampered by the regulatory framework in Illinois. Coming from Illinois, we'd love to grow the business as much as we possibly can in this state, and there's certainly more potential in this state for more than two distill brew pubs. These concerns are exactly why Senator Barrickman is here, to find out if there's any way he and his Senate colleagues can help businesses like distill grow and prosper in the land of Lincoln. This is why it's important that we go into our districts and interact with people so that we can see uh, truly how the decisions we make in Springfield impact the people that we represent at home.